vlogtober day one hey day one hey okay, y'all so today is i always clap when i be like today is and then i look to the side because i'll be trying to think <laughs> today is wednesday september the 20 27th october i mean september the 27th if i said october i'm looking crazy y'all y'all see my hair is a mess child so tomorrow we are going on a girl's trip so today we have a busy day so let me just catch y'all up i'm gonna try to make it quick so tomorrow i leave to go out of town for my friend's birthday my flight leaves at 105 p.m i need to be leaving this house though at 10 because I have to travel to Richmond, which is about an hour and five minutes away. Then I want to give myself a little 30 minutes because I have to park in the garage. So I want to be at least an hour and 30 minutes early just in case it's busy, yada, yada, yada. So today I have to finish doing everything that I need to do. I have not packed. I still have things that I need to get. I still need to clean up. I still have to do my hair, which y'all know my hair already in the sew-in, but I haven't put like no heat to it. I don't put heat on my hair unless it's like i'm going somewhere you know what i'm saying let me flat iron it real quick but even then y'all y'all could tell like even from my last um please do not mind my dick on what's the thing called smoke detector beeping like it's been driving me crazy and i told him to put batteries in it but yeah so my hair is definitely thinning out i told y'all that it was shedding and i could tell that it's thinning out but it's not to the point where it's like crazy so I really don't like wearing my hair like straight unless it's fresh because you know when it's fresh it got that movement to it know what I'm saying but like as the days go on and like you know what I'm saying it just start moving around sweating yada 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 it get kind of you know just a little little oily a little oily I'm going to actually um like try to you know put some curls in it with a flat iron but i want to use the wand curler because i don't want it to be like wand curls so i'm gonna try to do the flat iron let me show y'all the video that i had saw see hair strings on pinterest can y'all see it hold on let me turn the brightness down okay so i saw this video that jada posted on it's probably old but it was on pinterest and she flat iron she added curls to her hair with a flat iron so i like this look it's not like curly like tight curls but it's not straight either and mine would definitely probably be shorter than that because my hair like where she have it at and i don't want to curl it too much because my hair is already short and i don't want it to be like up here you know what i'm saying we have to do that today so pack let me write this down y'all okay let me need to clean up. So we're going to write that down first. Clean up. Okay. Oh, I can add a note. <laughs> okay. Clean up. So when I say clean up, I mean straighten up downstairs again. Because I cleaned up downstairs yesterday. But I need to do it again today. Straighten up downstairs. Fold clothes. Clean bathroom. And straighten up office room okay boom how i go to the next one oh, there we go <laughs> okay um so i need to clean up i need to check in for my flight at 105 p.m. I think I already set an alarm. Did I? Let me check. Uh, alarms. No. They say check dryer, but I'm going to know what it's for. Okay, I'm going to set it at 1 o'clock. Then check in for flight. Then I need to... Um, ooh, then I need to go back to cleaning up but being that i wrote clean up already i'm gonna just leave it alone but i need to go ahead and get my car inspected at three o'clock i have an appointment i went this morning to go get it inspected and he told me to come back at three o'clock and i asked him how long because it's close to my house y'all i was gonna walk it's like a 20 minute walk so i was gonna walk but when i went this morning he was like you have to have an appointment he was like can you come at three today i said well how long will it take he said 30 minutes boom i could sit in there and wait 30 minutes 
I ain't mad at it. So three o'clock. Then you know I have to go get the kids by six, yada, yada, yada. Oh, I need to pick up my contacts. Do I really? I might as well, I'm gonna be out there. Pick up contacts. Okay. Um, I need to get back here. I need to go to finish line and get shoes. I also need to go to Target and get outfit for tomorrow. Target, H&M, one of them. Um, I also need to open up packages with y'all and pack. I think that's it, y'all. Oh, do hair. Should I do my hair in the morning? Probably, because it's going to be kind of messed up. So I might as well do it in the morning. I should be able to have time to do it in the morning because I don't have to take the kids tomorrow. I need to be leaving here at 10. I said 10, right? Okay, leaving here at 10. If I pack tonight, then I won't have to worry about packing tomorrow. It might be a little things that I have to put in there, you know what I'm saying, stuff that I got to use, like toothpaste or whatever. Oh, I need to go to Target and get outfit for tomorrow and essentials. Edit video. Edit video for 10 1, which is the day y'all watching this, which is this video. But I have to edit it. I'm not going to be here 10 1 to edit it and upload it because I'm uh, still be out of town. So I need to edit it and upload it before I leave. So when I leave, I can still have it uploaded for y'all because I do not have a Mac computer. Uh, I mean, a Mac laptop, a Mac laptop to edit it on the go so i want to show y'all what i got i got some packages from amazon i also got some clothes from fashion nova and i'm actually happy about it because they are cute i have some shoes that's supposed to, oh let me stop recording because it's definitely still going i have some shoes that i ordered from tori birch and it's supposed to be here today y'all it's being shipped fedex so I hope it comes today because let me tell you, I always have the hardest time with FedEx. I did, uh, I did record like a little bit this past weekend, but I trashed the video y'all because I was just in the house not doing anything. The main things that I showed y'all was my nails. So I'm gonna just show y'all my nails now. I got some new nails. Okay, y'all. Oh, I hate the way my knuckles be looking. <laughs> I got some new nails. They're like chrome and they got a little gem on it. I also got the new iPhone. So this is the iPhone 15 Pro Max, and this is how it looks. Pretty much nothing different than the, the other iPhone. I mean, it is, but it's not. So a couple of things that I have noticed so far that I do like about this phone. So my 13 Pro Max, when I looked at my camera like this, hold on, wait, let me just take it off the case so y'all can see it. Also, I got the titanium um, silver one. It matches my nails. <laughs> okay, so when I look at the camera like this, I don't know if y'all can tell, but it's other than like the outer part of it being raised, the actual lens part, like the glass part, is not raised up too much. What I noticed with my 13 Pro Max, which is the phone that I just upgraded from, I noticed that that the, the lenses were very much raised like outward so my 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 lens were always dirty always you know what i'm saying and it's good to clean your lens before you take pictures or whatever because you know how you open your camera and it might be a little blurry or whatever and i ran into that issue a lot because when i'm out and about i'll be vlogging like this and then i always have to clean my camera off because it's just it just always got dirty so i like that in this case that i have it kind of has like a little lip protection for the camera part so even if i lay it down the actual lenses is not touching whatever surface is laying on so other my, my lenses haven't really i haven't been having to clean them you know what i'm saying if my fingerprints get on it then yeah and then i also like that now instead of this button that's right here usually this button is just where you can silence or um 
turn up the volume on your well not turn up the value like you can silence or unsilence your phone so now you can change it to where this can be an action button for whatever you want it to be so for me i made an action button to automatically open my camera because being that i be vlogging on the go sometimes things be happening i'll be like dang i wish i could have caught that on camera but by the time it's like i look at the phone make sure it's lit up push this button down here it just be too much so I really wish that it automatically opened up to video. I wonder if I can change that. I'm going to see. Because I would love for it to automatically open up on video versus opening up to picture. Because most of the time, I be needing video. Let me see right quick. Camera. Oh, yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, you can change it. So you can change it to whatever you want it to, to open up to. So photo, selfie, video, portrait, portrait, selfie. So I'm going to change mine to video. Boom. I love that. Okay. Also, the camera quality, what? Y'all, it will humble you so quick. I looked at my face, I said, dang, am I that ugly? Cause baby, I mean, if I am, just let me know, honey. <laughs> but anyway, that's the update on that. So I, I showed y'all my new phone. Um, I, I'm gonna show y'all my clothes. I got some packages from Amazon, which they are just sitting here, y'all right here waiting for me to open them up but i still have two other pack well i don't know if it's gonna be two two other items i don't know how many packages is gonna come in but i'm waiting for that to come and say it'll be here by 10. now back to what i was saying about my tory birch sh shoes that i order i ordered some tory birch sh tory birch shoes they're getting shipped by fedex but the reason why i was saying that i hope that fedex delivers them is because when it came down to my phone my phone was supposed to be delivered september the 22nd i was tracking it tracking it tracking it september the 22nd came they changed the delivery date to monday september the 25th and somebody had to be home and i didn't know if i was gonna be home monday so i'm like no i need my phone today so I had to go up there. I had to call them, ask them, could I pick it up from the actual facility? They said yes. So I had to go up there. But I run into that issue a lot with FedEx. They'll say they be delivering it on a certain date. Then it don't be that day. And then next thing you know, it gets pushed back to the next day or whatever. So I don't know, y'all. Because right now, this is saying that it's... I don't know. It still says today. It says by end of day. It says 12.40 p.m. to 4.40 p.m. But it's but right now it's 12.29 p.m. So I don't know if it didn't get transitioned over to out for delivery because it's not 12.40 yet. So I don't know. But I hope it get delivered because that go with one of my outfits. I need to go to finish line to get some other shoes that I got from another one of my outfits. So, yeah. So that's everything that we need to do, you guys. It's 12.30 right now. I got about... 35 minutes before I have to check in. But in the meantime, in between time, I'm going to go upstairs and, well, maybe I should start down here. Yeah, I'm going to freshen up down here and then get that out of the way. And then I'm going to go upstairs and finish what needs to be finished. <laughs>
it's a little bit later now it's about almost seven o'clock i um so a couple of things i finished pretty much i finished cleaning up everything but the bathroom so i have to do that i'm kind of irritated y'all because i put this day i put a mighty patch on this pimple yesterday and now it's like coming back so that's irritating because it's just like why why do you want to do this when i'm about to go why do you want to do this in general first of all but i am on my menstrual so maybe that's it anyway y'all i i just feel so like raggedy right now because this is how i always look every time i like nonetheless so i got my car inspected um i got there at three o'clock he didn't actually take my car until 3 30 but he finished quick so i was out of there by four so i can't complain about that that's less than an hour y'all know how it is usually when you wait you know you get your car inspected you be there all day or they take all day so i'm glad that i could get that done um what else what else what else i still have not got my package from fedex y'all my my shoes from <laughs> my shoes from tory burch and i really need them for an outfit and i'm just like it's so like fedex gets on my nerves i'm not gonna hold you they really get on my my hands FedEx really gets on my nerves and I say that because they are just so unpredictable when it come down to okay are you gonna get it or are you not gonna get it or are you gonna get it or are you not gonna get it or like it say that it's gonna be out for delivery today but is it really gonna be out for delivery today but the problem that I'm having with this one is it does not stay out for delivery however it has not updated to show that it's not gonna be delivered today you, so that's what irritates me because sometimes they just do not update it and I just I can't wait until tomorrow because it's just like I needed today today um so that's that but my friend did used to work for FedEx and she was saying that um it's shipping FedEx ground and they ship until like 8 p.m at night well they deliver until 8 p.m at night so there's still a chance y'all but i don't know how it's looking honey i tried to call and speak to somebody to see like is it on a truck or is it not on a truck because if it's not on a truck and it's at the facility i will come get it however they it's like you know how you can finesse the automated system is no finesse in that system like literally they would not let me talk to nobody even when i kept saying customer service it said customer service cannot give you any more details than what we already gave you on this automated system like dang y'all ghetto automated system talking to me like that anyway so i'm just hoping that i get it y'all cross our fingers um so i'm on my way to finish line i'm about to get these shoes that i told y'all i wanted to get um they close at seven so i'm trying to hurry up the kids is back at the house their older brother is watching them um so yeah that's where we at right now if i am able to go to target i'm gonna just run in target right quick so i ain't gotta worry about coming back out later but i don't know we're gonna see Secured. All right, now we about to run the target right quick. These are the sweats right here that I was talking about, but like you know, like the straight leg. I like the straight leg. Or should I get black? You know, I like the gray kind of be. They're just straight leg sweats, but I like that versus the other. Okay. Y'all, I'm on my way back home from Target, but let me tell y'all. Sorry, it's so rainy, y'all. It's dark, so yeah but anyway why these two girls got caught stealing in there <laughs> and the crazy i didn't even realize that they were still i mean maybe because i won't pay them no mind but they was in self-checkout they rung up whatever they rung up but i'm guessing they didn't ring up everything and i did see these two guys walking around that looked just regular i thought they were just like regular guys just in there like they look just like regular y'all like young black dressed like urban like everything like you would never think that they was like undercover like what's that loss prevention or whatever they let them walk out the door out the crazy thing is the, the girls was beautiful makeup done hair done wig on everything let them walk out the door turn them right back around i'm sorry i would have ran off <laughs> okay i'm outside he ain't about to make me come back inside and make a uh uh example out of me uh -uh. 
kind of irritated if you can't tell because deck on um FedEx did not deliver my package. It literally, as soon as like eight o'clock hit, it changed to um delivery delayed. And it don't even give an update of when it will be delivered. But that that's what pisses me off because it's just like y'all couldn't have been said it was delayed all day. That way I could have possibly came and picked it up. Like that's that's just what be pissing me off with FedEx. It really does. Like I call it every single time with them because it's just the same thing every single time. But anyway, let me go ahead and open these packages, you guys. Um I look a mess. What is this? Oh, my necklace. I ordered a necklace. Oh, it come in a little cute little case. <laughs> I ordered this necklace to go with one of my outfits. Ooh, this is giving choker. Y'all know I'm being now. Ooh, this is definitely giving choker. I gotta see how this go, honey. This is giving choker. This is giving, yes, look at this. This is tight. I gotta see how this look. Honestly, might not be bad because of the outfit I'm wearing. Oh no, y'all! It's kind of. Let me um turn the lights white so y'all can see me better. We'll see how that goes. All right. So I also got these containers. Um, these are some travel containers that you can put different things in. So I'm pretty much gonna be using mine for my facial cleanser moisturizer really no soap oh well oh i could do body lotion i didn't even think about that because i didn't even get no lotion and i meant to so i'm gonna do body lotion facial cleanser um should i do sunscreen because that means i gotta yeah yeah i don't know one of my outfits which is the same outfit that that um necklace that i just showed y'all yeah this is my hat so I have this outfit right here, you guys, which is actually what I got those shoes from Finish Line for. So this is, y'all just gonna have to see it when I put it on, like the whole, like the vision, because I'm not doing that right now. <laughs> so this is a jean, um, this is a strapless. So this is the top part right here. It's like a forest green, green color, um, a jumpsuit. So cute. I got this hat to match it which is just a New York Yankees hat and it has the green in it. It has a red underneath the cap. Oh yeah, and it fit good too. Okay, per. I need a hat and y'all see the jumpsuit. And then these are the shoes that I got to match with because y'all, I'm not really a heels person, y'all know that. So if I don't have to wear heels, I'm not. So I wanted to dress this outfit down, but still cute. So that's why I got these, the green to match with the jumpsuit. These are supposed to be like running shoes, but I probably would not use it for that. I don't know. <laughs> All right, so I had to get these boot, this boob tape one for that outfit right there because it's like it's not loose up top but i just wanted to be snug you know what i'm saying and i also got these travels um these are travel perfume sprays so I, like if i have a big bottle of perfume i could just spray some in these containers and use it when i travel instead of carrying the the you know the whole big thing and even if I do have a travel size, like one of them, like my Ariana Grande um, Cloud perfume, that one is travel size, but I probably would still put it in this because this is more, it, it's more secure versus it being in a glass container. I just have to figure out how to do this. I'm pretty sure how to use, remove the nozzle off your perfume bottle. Put the bottom of the perfume 
atomizer onto your perfume nozzle. Make the perfume atomizer is. We'll figure it out because I don't know how. To... <laughs> Cube organizers for when I pack my stuff because I saw Aaliyah's face use these. And I was like, you know what? Let me try that to, you know, to minimize space. So it's pretty much a set. But it's a set of different cubes. And you could just put your outfits in them and then zip it up. But you could put like more than one outfit. So they're supposed to save space. So I'm going to use that definitely because I'm trying to only carry one luggage. And it even comes with like um, a drawstring bag. And I can use this for like my underwear. And it also comes with a, like a travel uh, zip a zipped travel bag so yeah all of those things came in this little thing right here so hopefully it saves some space in my bag because i always feel like i never have enough room and i just feel like what do i have in there i do have one y'all remember i bought one from target but y'all it was just so cheap so i didn't know this came with two well, this was two. That was seven nine. It was seven dollars and ninety nine cent for both of them together. So I got this one because I felt like it was a little bit more secure. It was like this, and you open it up. More. Y'all, these nails is gonna be. Oh wait, am I opening it the wrong way? Oh, there it go. All right. You pop this part off and then it's the inside. And then I got this purse, you guys. And this purse is to also match with that green um, outfit that I just showed y'all. And it's supposed to be like a, um, y'all know the, I think it's like, I think it's called a Dior saddlebag. But of course, this is not Dior, this is Amazon. <laughs> okay. So this is how the bag looks. It's supposed to be, I don't even want to say like a dupe because it's not exactly like, of course, like the Dior bag. It doesn't say Dior on it, but this is how the Dior bag looks. But the Dior has, Dior bag has a D hanging from it. But yeah, they have different colors. So I'll link it if you guys are interested. And it did come with this crossbody right here. But I don't know if I'm wearing this or not. I might just carry the bag. I don't know. And from Target, I got some travel stuff, but this is not travel. This is the soap I always use, but I just wanted to get a new soap. So I got this, of course, to go into the soap container. And I got some travel Listerine. This is the moisturizer that I use, the, the triple repair moisturizing cream that I ran out of. I got some toothpaste, some hand wipes toothbrush i buy this every time i go somewhere y'all and i lose it every time i don't understand and this is new the cerave makeup removing balm because they say that wipes makeup removing wipes aren't good for you and i do feel like they break me out so being that i use the cerave cleanser i'm gonna try this and see how this goes so this is how that looks and then these are some jeans that i got y'all these jeans fit me so good and i'm surprised because they are a size eight they pro I probably can fill up fit them only because they're relaxed jeans so they have a little bit more room i just picked up an eight and i was like i'm gonna fit inside of it but it has like a rip on the side so i like that but these are some jeans that i got from target along so i'm gonna wear this outfit probably tomorrow this jacket that i got i don't know if y'all I, I think i mentioned this jacket to y'all but I saw it in Target. I've been having my eye on it for a while. But I was like, you know what? I'm going to get it when the time is right. So now I got it. And this is the jacket. And I love it. It's by, you know how like um, Target has the different brands? It's called Future Collective. And they have different designers that collab with this brand. So I don't even know what the girl name for this one is. Oh, Reese Bloodstein. This is the name right here. But I thought this jacket was so cute. So I'm going to wear it with those jeans. The only thing I'm hesitant about, you guys, is because I was going to wear these heels with it just to make it a cute outfit. But this green and this green don't really go. But maybe I can finesse it. I don't know. 
and then to wear tomorrow just to travel i got this oversized kind of um it's a little cropped hoodie and i'm gonna wear y'all know that black jumpsuit i wore tonight where i wore for my birthday and it was kind of like a low back you can see my back out so i got this hoodie to go over because i didn't want my back out all in the airport you know what i'm saying and then i got this blue jumpsuit with y'all this fit me so good now this is what i needed my dad on shoes for so i'm gonna have to go on a goose chase tomorrow to try to find my shoes because we're supposed to be going to some type of complex thing and i want to wear my i want to wear that outfit and then i got me a corset you guys this corset looks so good on but i'm gonna have to need help have, and this also i need um tape for this also because yeah my breast was definitely out but y'all just gonna have to see the vision with this because this is all taken apart and then these are the pants that i'm gonna wear with it y'all just gonna have to see y'all because i know right now i'm just showing y'all but y'all gonna have to see it y'all gonna see it of course when i put it on but yeah these are the pants and i'm so mad because i wanted to wear some heels with this outfit and now i can't find the heels i could find one but not the other and i don't know where is that so i'm gonna just have to figure something out with that and then for dinner one night we're wearing black so <laughs> i know this don't look like nothing right now but it's actually cute one i like it and that's it that's the haul so now we have to pack So clean up, I kind of completed because I just did straighten up downstairs. I did fold clothes, but I did not fully clean the bathroom, like clean the shower and everything like that. I just straightened up the countertop and I did not straighten up the office room, but it's not that bad, honestly. Um, so we're just gonna, we're gonna check mark that, okay. So check in for flight, I did that. 
get car inspected i did that i did not pick up my contacts so delete that go to finish line and get shoes i got that go to target and get outfit for tomorrow and essentials i did that i opened up the packages with y'all i packed with y'all now i'm about to sit here and edit my camera had went dead y'all so that's why some of the footage is like vertical and then some horizontal so i'm gonna end the vlog right here you guys of course i'll see you tomorrow y'all gonna come along with me we're gonna be vlogging it's gonna be a time honey so tomorrow y'all we have to go on a goose chase to try to find my package honey try to find my package but i need to make sure everything is situated today so i can leave out tomorrow at 10 o'clock but i gotta go there tomorrow morning and um seven i'm gonna try to get there at 7 30 and hopefully because it said that it's under the driver's discretion if they can tell you like where the driver is at and you come get the package from them because baby i'll come to you where you at honey where is you at because i need i need my stuff <laughs> all right y'all see y'all tomorrow